and welcome to May's studio vlog. Uh, it is very, very short. Not because I didn't have a lot to do, but because I had so much to do that what I recorded is unbelievably boring. I mean, I have like multiple hours of footage of packing your orders, which is amazing to me, but I feel like you don't want to watch multiple hours of me packing orders. I basically only packed orders that took me about three weeks. Because it's just me over here, I do all of the packaging myself. Uh, and I'm still getting used to selling, like, a lot. In the very beginning of my small business, um, tip to growing artists out there, I only sold, like, one print a week, which was so exciting for me! That was the biggest deal ever. Uh, and so when I ordered packages and paper and ink and all that, I really, I only ordered very small quantities because I knew I wasn't going to use through them that quickly, but this year my business has changed and I'm not used to ordering big quantities of supplies. Uh, and so lots of my time this month was ordering new supplies, waiting for them, using them completely up, and then having to go get more and waiting for them. Obviously I'm not going to stick all of that in the vlog for you today, but uh, you get to enjoy me working on a secret project uh, and then also packing orders and a little bit behind the scenes into my life as an artist. I promise I'm going to record a lot more in June and July. It's like the start of market season at the end of June and then July it just picks up and doesn't stop. So I have a lot to share with you, I'm very excited about those. Um, so just kind of use this as a cute little update uh, as to how my May has gone and look forward to the June one. In other news, I went to a concert in Vancouver. Um, if you're new here, I am a huge concert addict. Uh, so that was really fun in May. Uh, it was actually three days after I got tattooed. Uh, which is not the smartest thing, I think, to go to a concert, punk concert, three days post-tattoo. But I made it out, they made it out, um, and so now I have a cool story and cool tattoos. That was the start of my May, and then this video is everything after that. If you are one of the many that have stumbled upon me past my viral TikToks this past month, um, I really appreciate you coming by. Uh, this is just another one of the platforms that I'm on. I am definitely not as active here as I am on Instagram and TikTok, but I try to upload a vlog every single month. This account is basically just my virtual diary as a full-time artist that's trying to grow her career, uh, and people can use that as kind of like a guide for themselves, or just um, watch me as I grow. And then for me, I just like to look back on it, so um, if you're here, welcome. I really hope you enjoy the rest of the vlog. Thank you. 
Today is May 23rd. It is a Tuesday. Uh, I took yesterday off for a Canadian holiday thing, uh, which was really nice. But now I'm back into working. Uh, it's been so busy <laughs> these last couple of weeks. Um, I had my store kind of blow up a little bit. Last week I was simultaneously packing a lot of orders and then also working on this project. Basically, uh, this has taken up all of my time and I'm exhausted but very excited and we get to continue working on it this week. So this is actually 13 illustrations that my friend um, asked me to do for his local magazine. He has a magazine called Jawbone, which is really cool. It's like a bunch of local, uh, local to my area, uh, artists, poets, um, short storyists, comics, uh, just creative people from my local area. My friend compiles into a magazine and releases it whenever he feels like. He asked me to be in the next edition. Um, he wanted me originally to write a short story and then illustrate it, but um, my writing skills are kind of rusty. We brainstormed an idea that I would create a story with no words and then illustrate it, um, and I immediately had an idea. And uh, he only gave me like 14 days <laughs> to work on this, and my idea was way too lofty to finish in 14 days. Um, but I went ahead uh, with this delusion that I could, and um, I finished the sketches in those 14 days, and um, he actually extended the deadline, which allowed me to just kind of relax and <laughs> continue working on this a lot more slowly. Uh, and through that, um, this is still going to be in his magazine, but I had a desire to make my own booklet of this as well and uh, sell it online in my markets. Uh, you know, giving myself another deadline because my markets are in a month. A month and two days is my first market. Thankfully, I finished the art and now I just have to turn it into a book and get that book into my hands. Fingers crossed. <laughs> so I want to take you along and um, format this book together. Uh, I unfortunately did not film the process working on this because I kind of feel like when I work on art and then I take out my camera it totally like ruins any sort of flow that I had and I almost feel like the art that I'm making is worse when I film. So I was in the zone when I made these and so unfortunately you don't get to see that process um, but you get to see the process from here on out. <laughs> so today we're going to be erasing all these pencil marks um, on these 13 illustrations and then I have to scan them, I have to edit them, and I have to format them into a book to order. <sighs> Can I finish this before my market next month? Who knows? <laughs>
So sick.
this video is short and sweet. I'm really grateful for everyone who watches my videos and encourages me as I'm growing as an artist. Um, I, I'm reaching a point now, like I'm still quite small online, but I'm reaching a point Me two years ago, I did not think I would reach this point. I have a thousand subscribers on YouTube. Um, I'm almost at 10,000 on Instagram. Um, I'm almost at 100,000 on TikTok. Numbers don't matter at all. Like I, if I had four followers, I would be so grateful. <laughs> The fact that I am here is really, really cool. So thanks for sticking around. I also wanted to mention that I have a Patreon. Uh, this is my second month doing it. It's so much fun. Uh, these were the prints for May. I'm in the middle of trying to start up like a Patreon exclusive shop where if you join Patreon now, you can have access to all the prints and stickers that I've added previously. So that was May's sticker and print. Uh, I have June sticker and print mapped out already, but you'll have to wait until next video. Or sign up and you'll see. I will see you in June. I also want to show my cute outfit. I got these new pants. Whoa. I got these new pants. I love them. I'm living in them. I'm not leaving them. Um, this is what I'm going to look like for the rest of my life.